How many children escaped indoctrination? It's impossible to know. As 10 years of Nazi rule passed by, the Hitler Youth lost its appeal as something exciting. It was now compulsory, backed up by Gestapo laws and busybody Hitler Youth patrols. More and more, the rebellious thing was to refuse to join. These photographs are the only surviving pictures of German youth gangs in the early 1940s. The Edelweiss Pirates, the Texas Band, the Navajos. They beat up Nazi officials, wrote graffiti on walls, but mostly they just hung out and listened to American jazz. Their casual, fun-loving attitude made a mockery of Nazi control. They dance outrageously. They call it swing. Sometimes two boys with one girl. Sometimes all together in a wild circle. Girls wear lipstick and paint their nails. It's monstrous. I remember one time when a group of jazzers had gathered on the pier to play Louis Armstrong, Duke Ellington, not disturbing anyone. But jazz was un-German. And so the self-important Hitler Youth leader marches up and orders them to stop this Jewish nonsense. But the jazzers stripped his clothes off, stuffed the most disgusting things into his mouth, I will not say what, and they chucked him in the river by the sewage outflow. The whole thing took no more than a few minutes. The government hit back. Curfews were ordered to stop young people visiting bars after nine o'clock. Hanging round and smoking in public were banned. Forced labor for those that broke the rules or death. This photo shows the fate of 12 young Edelweiss pirates caught in Cologne in 44. <laughs> 